What are protochordates? What comes to your mind when you hear the term chordata? Do images of animals with the notochord fill your mind? I guess not, but it's true. A chordate is an animal belonging to phylum chordata. Chordates possess a notochord, a hollow dorsal nerve cord, pharyngeal slits, an endostyle, and a postal anal tail for at least some period of their life cycle. On the basis of development of notochord, phylum chordata is classified into two subphylum protochordata and vertebrata. The members of subphylum vertebrata possess notochord only during their embryonic stage. However, the notochord is replaced by a cartilaginous or bony vertebral column in the adult stage. Vertebrates have two, three or four chambered ventral muscular heart and a pair of the kidney for excretion and osmoregulation. Examples are birds, reptiles and mammals. On the other hand, members of phylum protochordate possess notochord throughout their life. Besides this, they have ventral heart, perforated gill slits and a post-anal tail. Protochordates are further divided into three groups which are hemichordata, urochordata and cephalochordata. Let's learn about these three groups of protochordates. The first one is hemichordata. The members of hemichordates are marine and have an organ system level of body organization. The notochord is present only at the anterior end of the body. Their body is divided into a proboscis, a collar and a long trunk. Respiration takes place through gills. Sexes are separate and fertilization is external. An example is Bolanoglossus. Please note that on the basis of recent research and study, hemichordates are now placed in separate phylum under non-chordata. The second one is urochordata. Members of urochordates are exclusively marine and notochord is present only in the larval tail and absent in adults. The body is soft and resembles tadpoles in the larval stage and develops cuticular tunics in adults. An example is acidia. The third group is cephalochordata. Members of cephalochordata are usually buried in soil and notochord extends from head to tail region. Respiration takes through paired gill slits. Cephalochordates have a well-developed circulatory system but lack blood cells. They have soft long bodies and sexes are separate. An example is branchiostoma. This concludes our video on protochordates and their groups. Let's answer a few questions based on this topic. Question 1. Notochord is restricted to anterior part of the body called proboscis in an animal of which group? Number 1. Hemichordata Number 2. Urochordata Number 3. Cephalochordata Number 4. Chordata This question was asked in BHU 2009. Solution In hemichordates, the body is divisible into a proboscis, collar and trunk in which the notochord is restricted to the anterior part of the body. Hence, option 1 is correct. Question 2. Which of the following feature is found in chordates but are absent in non-chordates? Number 1. Spiracles. Number 2. Post-anal tail. Number 3. Chitinous exoskeleton. Number 4. Gills. This question was asked in JIPMA 2010. Solution. Post-anal tail occurs in most of the chordates at least in the embryonic stage. In the majority of chordates, it helps in balancing. The tail provides protection to the genital and anal region. Hence, option 2 is correct. To know more about other groups of animals, please watch our next video. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more interesting and educational videos, to earn while you learn, download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.